Let's read this. Oh, what? When you reach level 3 or higher, return to Caius for more orders. Well, we said we would take the Pilgrim's Path, so let's, uh, let's be true to our word. The Pilgrim must visit each of the Shrines of the Seven Graces. At each site, the Pilgrim must stand before the three-sided stone Triolith and read the inscription. To ease the Pilgrim's task, the Temple has made this list of shrines along with the directions and advice to Pilgrims. The blessings of each shrine last at least half a day. Fields of Kumu, Shrine of Humility. Here, Lord Vivek met a poor farmer whose guar had died. Okay, west of Saran, on the north shore of Lake Amaya, as you head towards Pelagiad. Alof's farm nearby has a small dock on the north bank. Oh. Oh, great. Hopefully, uh, the farm doesn't change hands over the next, uh, few decades, or else this book will have to be completely republished. But it's west of Saran. And uh, we can travel to Saran. I know there's a lady that will give me like 100 gold if I take her to the fields of Kumu, but I don't think it's worth it. It's not worth chasing after that friggin' lady. Oh. Okay, yeah, right there. I'm glad it's on my on my map. Oh my god. This rat is destroying me. I can't even rest here. That doesn't even have any gold. Can you let Hunjara go free? Um, maybe tomorrow. We haven't had any Dark Brotherhood attacks in a while. Which is a good thing, but also... A bad thing, because... Then we don't have any money. Our entire business model is based on the uh, the premise that we're going to be attacked by assassins, and if we're not, then what's the point? We're going to go broke. Oh my god. A Kagudi? He sees us. Let's, let's mantle Lord- oh my god. Oh no. Oh no. We got destroyed. We cannot mantle Lord Vivek because... We can't bash the Kagudi's head in. Oh my god. Wait, at least get this, uh... The fields of... Oh, this is the field here. Like, what is this? The fields of... There's no fields here. This is just... Rocks. Vivect acted as a beast of burden. Well, we did it. We read the thing. But what is this about? But Thorinor here. Your friend is lost? Well, you gotta figure it out. To stop the moon, the shrine of daring. When Shiogorath rebelled against the tribunal, he tricked the moon, Bardal, into forsaking its appointed path through oblivion. The mad star inspired the moon to hurl itself upon Vivek's new city, which Shiogorath claimed was built in mockery of the heavens. When Vivek learned of Shigroth's scheme, he froze the rogue moon in the sky with a single gesture and the grace of his countenance. Overwhelmed by the courage and daring of Vivek, the moon, Bar Dao, swore itself to eternal service of the tribunal and all its works. Thus the moon, 
now stands guard over the palace and serves as a citadel for the temple's ordinators. The Surrounded Daring is found in the city of Avec in the Temple District, along the western wall of the High Fane, the great temple of Vardenfell. It is customary to leave behind a potion of rising force. What do you think, guys? You think we're close enough to Vivek? I don't think so. We're in Balmora. That's fine. 12 gold. It's probably like 20 at the Celt Strider. Shoot. I think I want more Rising Force potions, so let's let's see if we can buy some from anyone in here. I don't have to buy this expensive Rising Force potion, but I guess I have to. We buy it for 185. Yes, we got a good deal today. Oh my God, they're. they're My journal got updated when I read this. Oh, shoot. Donating it caused me to drink it? I better uh, get down before this ends in disaster. Oh, is that him crushing the Shalk's head? Like he's so proud of? I screwed up because I didn't put, put muck at the, at the shrine. So I gotta find some muck. Let's get... Okay, perfect. So we've given the muck... to the shrine. And we updated our... journal. Next, it's the Shrine of Generosity. Long after Lord Nerevar and the Tribunal triumphed over Dagothar, the people wished to build a monument to the heroes of that war. Vivek thanked them, but said that it would be better to dedicate a monument not only to the glorious heroes, but to all people, great and small, who suffered and died in the war. It became the custom to make offerings here, either in thanks of our good fortune or for those less fortunate. It's on the steps of Vivek's palace. Shoot, I had to come all the way back here. I wasted time having to come back, but it's okay. It's okay, everyone. No need to have a heated gamer moment. But let's come over here so we can more reliably cast our Alms of the Intervention. It'll take us right to Vivek, hopefully. That it should work here. Perfect. Oh, is that it up there? Okay, they're both the same. What, all this is for Vivek. Oh, uh, Vivek is so great. Vivek is the best. I love Vivek. Vivek sucks. Trapped. I'm gonna break in and destroy him. Vivek is the best. Oh, we love Vivek here in Vardenfell. Alright, what's next? The Puzzle Canal. In a battle with Merun's Dagon. Vivek gave his own silver longsword to the Daedra Lord rather than dishonor himself by fighting an unarmed foe. This so impressed the Dremora, the most honorable and chivalrous of Mirren's Dagon's Daedric servants, that they now share a bond of respect and courtesy with the followers of the Tribunal. Though we must never forget that they are our enemies. The Shrine of Courtesy is found in the heart of the Puzzle Canal, a labyrinth beneath Lord Vivek's palace. I gotta bring a silver longsword. Let's see. There's probably... In the foreign quarter, I could probably find an armorer. I think I want to make a quesadilla, guys. What do you think? Smith. You've got my ear. Let's hear it. Silver longsword, please. Perfect. Please accept for 140 gold. Yeah, we're getting good at this. 
How do we get into this friggin' place? Do we just go in one of these grates? There's a Dramora in here. Can't believe this. They're letting us down. Letting the... Letting all these rats infest. Vivex screwing us up. Oh my god, this guy's... This rat's got a high agility to... Keep pounding us like this. This rat's gonna kill us. But we're not gonna let him. Is this the way you're supposed to navigate? Just run around like this? Until you find the place? Oh, is this it? Nice. I think we made it. There's supposed to be a Dramora in here. Right? I can't get in through there, can I? So we haven't done it yet. I think that I have a feeling the Dramora is up there, but I don't think we can get through that. Now we're somewhere completely different. There's another rat. This is not riveting at all. Not exciting in the least. Is there like any hint? Am I supposed to go where the rat is? No. That wouldn't make any sense. I'm gonna have to... I'm cheating. I guess he's supposed to be in here. Well... <sighs> Honestly, I never would have gotten that. I had to look it up and this is what we have to do. There it is. This is it, guys. How would I have got? How would I? I, I I'm just. Did I just. Is that in the journal? Nope. Nope. Are you here on the pilgrimage? I take it that several long sodas for me. As you see. I am unarmed, but you are brave and gallant. <sighs> Will you give me your longsword so that I may stand a chance against your might? Yes, please. Thank you for your courtesy, Lord Vivek. I shall speak neither hurtful nor harsh word, but shall speak respectfully even of my enemies. Your temperate words may turn aside anger, unless they're a shalk. Or kagudi, because then I'll bash their skulls in. Well, I'll take those to sell them, since I didn't have to friggin' buy one. Alright, that's four. The Shrine of Justice near the altar is Vivek's Ash Mask. In the days of fire, when Dagoth there first crept back into Red Mountain and awakened it, Vivek led refugees here as they fled the Ashen Blight. Weary, they rested here a while. When Vivek awoke, he found himself and all his followers encased in casts of grey ash. Frozen like a sleeping statue and unable to free himself or his help his people. It's guarded within the Nissus Temple in the village of Nissus. 
I need to leave a potion of cure common disease. Got it. In the days of old, before ash covered the lands and grass grew on the Red Mountain, the people found that they had not prepared any food for winter. So Lord Vivek pulled his pants down and pinched out a big loaf for all of his people to eat. Thank you for your generosity, Vivek. We love you. <sighs> Vivek sucks. They got Thur's gonna destroy the world. He's casting blight all over the place. Well, I guess I better just sit in my temple, says Vivek. Better just sit in my palace and not do anything. That's interesting, though, because isn't the only way to destroy Dagoth or to destroy the heart of Lorcan? The tribunal wouldn't want to do that, because that's where they get their power. That's interesting, because then they have a vested interest in not destroying Dagoth Ur. I don't have a cure disease potion, do I? Oh, I do. Shrine of the Mask. Thank you for your justice, Lord Vivek. I should be neither cruel nor arbitrary, for fair dealing earns the love, trust, and respect of our people. Oh. What did that do? Oh. I can only touch it. I can't take it. So I get to look at the real Ash Mask. Now we have to go to Coal Cave, the Shrine of Valor. Within the Coal Cave, Vivek fought a battle with Ruddy Man, the father of the Dre. When he defeated Ruddy Man, Vivek spared his life on the condition that Ruddy Man and his children would give up their tough hides to serve as armor for the Dunmer. The Shrine of Valor is inside the Coal Cave, a cavern on the seacoast, west of the ancient stronghold. Barandas and south of Nissus. Well, we're in Nissus. So that's good. The region is a wilderness and finding the cave mouth can be difficult. Oh boy, can't wait. Drew within the cave itself are fearsome enemies. Only experienced and capable adventurers should attempt to reenact the epic battle with the Drew in the cave. Do, do I have, does this mark, does this? Okay, there it is. They, they have uh, it marked. Coal cave entrance. Oh wow, we sent that guy rolling. Even though we didn't hit him that way. That's gotta be it. This has gotta be Coal Cave. Think we can do it, guys? This is where Vivek fought the ruddy man. Oh my god. can't even see. Oh, an adventurer. Hopefully this we don't end up like this guy. Let's try to heal up. Can't even really see. Look how slow I swim. Nope. That was a disaster. So unfortunately, I believe that we'll have to just go back to Caius for now. We're not strong enough, guys. We gotta, we gotta try to level up more. Caius, well please give me some orders. Yes, we've got 200 more gold. I've thought it over, and I want you to interview three... Informants in Vivek City concerning the Nereverine in the Sixth House. Oh my god. Adhiranir, a Khajiit Thieves Guild operative. I want to speak with 
Hulia, an Argonian in the Morag Tong. Marimilo, a temple priestess. Gotta go with St. Olms. And the Lower Waste Works. So let's go... We can get to the Lower Waste Works in the Foreign Quarter easily by taking... Uh, by teleporting to the Mage's Guild in Vivek. We're looking for the Black Shulk Corner Club. Black Shulk Corner Club. Got to talk to an Argonian. Yep. Friend. I welcome you as the friend of my friend, Billiam K. Jr. But I wish I'd go to my friend's bookstore. And these troublesome fools are in the way. I've tried to persuade them, but they hate my race and fear there'll be violence. Perhaps if you speak with them, but be careful and ready. A sight of a free Argonian offends these racist thugs. It would tarnish my Morag Tong honor to slay them. Is this regarding Lord? I'm talking to the filthy lizard. Some kind of filthy lizard lover? Let's intimidate him. It was a success. Um, guess I just gotta commit murder. Filthy lizard. This rotting piece of trash ought to be chained up somewhere. That is quite enough. This filthy lizard. Let's taunt him. I would lose. Yeah, we intimidated him successfully. Oh my god. Oh my god, he's gonna kill us. Is there a place that I can sleep? Shoot. Excuse me, madam. Do you have some uh, healing potions? Restore health, I'll take those. Yes, a true business. Oh no. Uh, please have a rising force potion. Oh no. If I steal something, will the guards come? The guards will not come. She'll just kill me. Shoot. Mm. Well, this is a bummer. Let's actually pick up a Rising Force Potion in case that happens again. That's something else we need alteration for. Levitating. Because that'll happen a lot. You'll get caught in a wall. Alright, let's try it again. Let's fight these troublesome fools. Let's see if this guy will follow me. You in I can't even hit this guy. Oh wow. This guy's taking care of him for me. Oh my god, things are uh, not going well. Good thing I got this Shane. And Sujama. And this Restore Health. Oh my god. You guys have anything good? 20 throwing knives? Nope. Well, 
I almost died again, but let's travel to Joe Bosch's rare books. That was close, guys, but uh, Huila pulled through with, with the hard carry. I hit the guy once, and uh... thank you, citizen. Is Joe Bosch even here? Tell me about the Nereverine cult. The Sixth House cult. He's never heard of such a thing. Next we gotta go to the Thieves Guild in St. Olms. I gotta find someone's bed to sleep in. This is looking bleak. Uh, I don't have any directions, just that this Khajiit is in St. Olms. So... this guy ever heard of him? Her name is... Wait, this guy's... This guy knows that Aradonir is a thief. Please tell me about Aradonir. This guy seems like he knows what's up. Move along. Maybe I can persuade him. Shoot. Ah, welcome. What may I do for you? Duvanius, you're letting me down. They say she's hiding, probably, so I'm guessing she might be down here in the canal works. A census and excise agent has been prowling the canton. Fla! And this agent, whose name is Duvenius Platorius. Oh! So she's hiding in the underworks. Yes, Alpha. Look for trap doors. Oh! Oh! Yes. So I guess I gotta go talk to that guy. Like, since he's an excise agent, they are collectors of the Emperor's taxes and tariffs, and the Emperor has outlawed trade in many things like Dwemer artifacts and ebony? What? I gotta make that- I gotta make that guy disappear one way or another. So let's see if we can, uh... If we can be civil about this. Or if we gotta... If we gotta whip out some bada-bing. Yep, she just took a gondola to the mainland. Now please leave Duvanius, Platorius. Perfect. He's gone. I'll tell you about the sixth house cult. Oh! Adhere near knows about it because it's about smuggling. Some smugglers are suddenly too busy for their old clients because they have a new employer, the sixth house, who pays very well. What do they smuggle? Oh, you don't know. They hush up like fat-bellied kitties full of sweet meats. Well, now I have to talk to this lady. Uh, Maramilo, Hall of Wisdom and Justice. Apparently I slept or something right here in the sewer. Because, in your dream, a tall figure with a golden mask greeted you, saying, There are many rooms in the house of the Master. Be easy, for from the hands of your enemies I have delivered you. It seemed you had died and could see yourself laid upon a table lit by candles, but with your own hands you touched the figure, and the figure drew breath, opened eyes, and rose from the table. Then the room was gone and the world filled with light, and you awoke. Oh my god. Yes, I need to speak with Maramilo. Is that you? Oh, Go of ahead, Outlander. What do you need? Citizen. We can't talk here, so let's just walk ten feet the other way. Oh, great. She doesn't know anything about that sixth house cult. Temple worships Nerevar as a saint and hero. Nerevar cult claims the tribunal are false gods. Progress of truth. I guess I gotta go back to Joe Bosch's rare books. Is there something I can do for you? You can... Oh my god. The way these, these, these halls are just too narrow. It's dumb. So let's see if Joe Basha has Welcome, traveler. Speak freely. Go on. This rare this rare book. Joe Basha, please barter with me. Confessions of a Skuma Eater. So what do I buy that? There it is, progress of truth. And you know what? Let's sell him. 
What? It's worth 200? And he's only taking a tiny discount off? Alright, we have Progress of Truth for Caius. Well, we've done Caius's dumb quest. Well met. Fetch Quest Mania. Just discuss me, discuss me orders. Okay. I have your report, and I'll make copies of your notes from Huila and the Progress of Truth. Okay, so he needs time. I'm being promoted to journeyman. We're doing good work. We've got 200 drakes. Perfect. Go do some jobs for the guilds or other freelance work, just to keep your cover story current. Or get some training. Then when you're fit and rested, come back and I'll have new orders for you. I'm not ready for you yet. I told you. Wow, Caius, rude. Confessions of a skooma addict. Of a skooma eater, is that you, Caius? Oh, he's shaking his head. Well, we'll, we'll go to the, we'll, tr we'll try to enter that cave next time and finish the seven graces. <clears throat> 